Um, <laughs> one thing I want to make sure you guys do as well, too, is just like make sure you're providing value within your emails. So, yeah. you know, think about the emails that you actually don't mind getting and like go back to. So, for example, for me, like when I'm, I'm designing stuff all the time for BeatStars and our graphics and all of those things, like one of my favorite sites emails me six free fonts every single Monday. Mm -hmm. And with that, I always open their email even to just see what they are just in case I might yeah. want one. Um, and even though I am not making a purchase, I still am getting something of value to me. So I'm gonna stay subscribed to them to make sure I'm getting that. And, you know, I know that when I do need a font, I know where I will get my fonts from because of that yep. reason. So it may not be something you're immediately seeing. If you want to put all of your, like, three free songs this week, you know, and that's the email you're sending out every every week to your followers, you know, that might be something of value opposed to just putting, here's a new song, here's a new song. Like, those are great, but, you know, what, what will you make your customers open it? Yeah. Yeah, providing value is important. And like you said, Aaron, just continuing to get in their face. Maybe, you know, as you know, artists aren't necessarily working on projects 12 months out of the year. So there may be a lot of times where your emails fall kind of flat, um, but you never know when somebody's looking and you may provide them the coupon that they need or the beat recommendation they didn't know they needed. And so mm -hmm. with that being said, like I said, just having this email marketing set up can be really, really um I guess, impactful to your business and potentially getting sales. That That's my favorite thing. One of my favorite things about BeatStars is being so affordable, $20 a month, or for those of you that don't know, uh, for if you sign up for the annual payment, so it'd be charged one time of year instead of, um, you know, 12 monthly charges you guys can save and it's about $14.99 a month. So anyways, the point being that that's about the cost of one beat sale or half a beat sale. So if you guys can get your marketing right, you can get these integrations really set up and you are maximizing usage. BeatStars is essentially going to be free of charge for you um, because the tools that are on this platform are going to be essentially taking care of that cost. Um, so make sure for those of you that do have a pro page or whether you're not, you're a marketplace member or free, just whatever you do, make the most of the platform. Um, because if you do, you're going to be setting yourself up for success. Um, but if you really don't utilize these tools to the best of their abilities, you could run into some hurdles.